a Dread Fun original production. Please sit back and enjoy. Guys, Dread Fun here with another one of my time lapse video uploads. Bom 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 ba bom bom ba bom. Time for me to draw a stormtrooper. Um, as I was laying this drawing out, I realized um, that I have never actually drawn a stormtrooper before. I mean, I might have done like you know just a few offhand sketches, but nothing even uh, even in my youth. I mean, I ripped off the whole Star Wars series franchise with my own Galactic Empire story that I've got downloaded on a YouTube video here, um, where I have sort of stormtrooper type characters. But other than that, I really haven't drawn many stormtroopers. So I was pumped to do this stormtrooper. I knew right away that it was going to be a crafty balance between the light and the dark. Ooh, very, very pun intended for the Star Wars thing. But, um, yeah, because it, it's white with small bits of uh, black. Um, and that can be real easy. You just do the outline and you're done. No, in order to make that white pop and sort of come off the page and look good with the three other images that accompany it, Darth Vader, Boba Fett, and a TIE Fighter, a Stormtrooper. I had to lay out the pencils very fine, very light, a lot of light smudging, whereas, you know, I'll get in there and dig with this one, it's a lot of light, loose smudging. Being very careful to where I lay out the, the, uh, the shading on the one side, because I then go in at the very end with my graphite eraser and I pull out like I've said a million times before, I pull out the graphite and uh, that makes it uh, pop off the page. Like an ink artist might use like a white pen ink to, to go over certain areas to highlight it. Um, in my case, I'm keeping those areas in mind, making sure I don't smudge them up too much and I use my graphite eraser to pull it out and make it look good. Uh, this one was relatively, I wouldn't say easy, but uh, you know, um, there's no eye to mouth to nose measurement. The only thing I was concerned about was the way that the, the helmets come around. It's kind of rounded. And I wanted to make sure I got a nice smooth round look to it. And overall, looks great. Hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to subscribe and check out my other content. Dreadfun out. This has been a Dreadfun.com production. Thanks for watching.